So Pisces, in this message, it seems like your person is giving you the silent treatment. There is more to the story, but you have to ask yourself, is this okay with you? Let's dive into the energy. Hello, everyone, and welcome in. Hope everyone is doing well. Positive healing vibes to all the subscribers, the viewers, and the world out there. Today, we're looking into Pisces inside of their mind reading for the month of March. In this message, Pisces, we're going to tap into the energy surrounding you, the energy surrounding your person. We're going to see what's challenging this between the two of you. Then we're going to dive a little bit deeper into your person's energy. And in this portion of the message, Pisces, we're going to look at their perception of you, their perception of the challenge. We'll look at what they aren't telling you in the present energy and what their true intentions are moving forward. I'm going to clarify throughout the message. I'll pull a few cards at the end for advice, guidance moving forward. If it's something you guys are interested in, you're more than welcome in joining us. Also, Pisces, if you like the vibe, how I interpret the cards, you're more than welcome to subscribe to the channel. Everyone's welcome, and it does help to set intentions for future messages. So, Pisces, let's see what we can see for your upcoming energy for the month of March. Please and thank you. Most important message here for Pisces, Spirit. What does Pisces need to see? I see an energy right out the gate. Pisces, I feel like your person is, you feel like your person is hiding something here. I feel here, Pisces, if your person is distant, they're not talking to you. Maybe it seems like they have their guard up. I feel like it's something personal that they're going through, most likely with family, family or friends. Now, for some of you, this could actually be like a death in the family that they aren't really expressing here. For some of you, they don't really know how to express their emotions or trying to find the words to say. I do feel like it does seem like there is other things going on than what they're telling you. So let's clarify. Let's clarify the energy here for you, Pisces, in the present moment. Now, if you find the message is helpful, resonating with your situation, please give it a thumbs up. All the love and support is very much appreciated. It does help with the growth and getting the message out there. So thank you guys so much for that. You are all freaking amazing. Let's start with the High Priestess Empress energy for Pisces here. I feel here, Pisces, that you're getting ready to walk away from this person. And a lot of you, it's because you feel like they're hiding something. Hanged man in the reverse with the four of swords. Take your time with this decision. Don't be so impulsive. Okay? Trust but verify. Trust but verify. Let's clarify this four of swords, the queen of cups, energy for Pisces person. I do feel like they aren't telling you exactly what they're going through. That is, that is very obvious. But I feel here, Pisces, it's deeper than that. It's almost as if they lost, there was a loss here that they've experienced. And I do feel like maybe it is like a loss within the family. Okay. Again, this person isn't telling you any of this. Okay. They're just distant. They're just silent. Okay. Almost as if they're giving you the silent treatment, but I don't feel like that's the case. I don't feel like they're ignoring you intentionally, to be honest with you, Pisces. Now, I just want to clear up really quickly before we get any deeper. 
This is not channeling an abusive type of a relationship, guys, where you have proof that this person has ran off and they've betrayed and they've hurt and all of those things. This is not what's going on here. This is a connection where was stable, was secure throughout a period of time. And then all of a sudden, out of nowhere, there was an abrupt disconnect. Okay. If that is resonating, I don't feel like this person has ill intention for disconnecting. And I feel like it's more of a personal issue. And I'm not saying that it's right for them to not talk to you about this. Okay. So that is definitely something that's going to need to be addressed. But just be open. Just be open. Okay. I feel like this person may come forward and have a conversation, but I feel here that they do feel like this is going to be a difficult conversation because how they handled their emotions or this experience wasn't, wasn't the proper way to handle things. Okay. Yes. They should have come forward and told you how they truly feel, what they were going through. Let's dive a little bit deeper here into your person's energy Pisces and see what comes out. going to start with their perception of you and the present energy. Thank you guys again for all the love and support. Pisces person's perception of Pisces spirit. What does Pisces need to see? I feel like this person looks at you as withholding information. If you're not telling them everything, Pisces. Maybe this is having to do with family, a family connection, or maybe this is your own healing process. This could be why they don't feel comfortable coming forward and expressing this to you. Because I feel like they see, they view you as you withhold information. Maybe you don't talk about negative experiences in your life and they don't want to disrupt your energy. But I do feel here, Pisces, that they view you as withholding some information or have in the past. What is this person's perception of the challenge here? What is this person's perception of the challenge I feel like this person is focused on their own happiness, on their own stability. They're most likely having to deal with some family issues, some things that are going on externally from themselves, okay? But they are still involved. Their happiness is being wavered here. I feel also they are very drained. When it comes to their emotions, they feel like there's blockages that are coming because of whatever ending challenge difficulty that they've currently experienced. And I feel like this is for a lot of you, this is going to be a death or a loss of some kind. This is definitely causing delays in the things that they've planned and the things that they see themselves doing moving forward. So what aren't they telling Pisces then, spirit, in the present energy? What's hidden? It's hidden here in this present energy. Please and thank you. Goodness gracious. So this person is definitely not speaking on how they're feeling. Okay. They are not telling you what exactly it is they're going through. I feel like they may not feel comfortable to express themselves here in this present energy. I feel like they they feel like this is going to cause disruptions in this connection. Now, I'm not saying that that's going to be the case, but I do feel like they feel very burdened by this loss and like they can't talk about it. And it might not just be to you, Pisces. This could be to a lot of other people, maybe this is how they handle challenges that they face. What I will always say though, guys, if a certain reaction that a person has, if this is a new connection, like say within the first six months to a year, and you find that this person's reaction isn't something that you feel like you can handle long term, then by all means, 
have a conversation about it, but you may need to put yourself first. You may need to put your own stability first here. So true intentions moving forward here for Pisces and this person, please. And thank you, Spirit. What does Pisces need to see? I feel like this person is trying to figure this out. It's almost as if they're trying to be strategic here, trying to figure out how to stabilize their own energy. Okay. I also feel here they're kind of closed off with how this is affecting other people. Okay. They're not really looking at this all around. They're not looking at the whole perspective of things. They're looking at the situation currently, Pisces, on how this is affecting their present energy and their present situation. That could involve you, but if this is a new connection, I feel like this connection is kind of being put to the side for now. I do feel, Pisces, that this person is going to try and come forward and have a conversation with you. And how you react or don't react to this conversation is it's going to determine how this plays out, okay, in the long run. Now, Pisces, what we see here coming out is a decision. There's going to be a decision, a conversation that's going to be had. This could boil down to putting yourself first. Pisces in the present energy because I do feel like your perception of this person disconnecting is off from how they perceive things and I'm not sure if you guys are going to be able to get back on that same page okay it may be time to walk away okay so let's pull a few cards out here for your advice guidance moving forward in the present energy Thank you guys again for all the love and support, for liking, subscribing, sharing the content. You guys are all amazing. I am going to do an extended version to the reading, guys. In the extended version, we're going to look at the hidden energy. We'll see where this is all headed, the lesson that's present, and the outcome if the advice is followed. It's all going down in the extended version, and the links are all below. Pisces. And this may be something... That you're resistant to in the present energy but try to have an open mind of how you should play this out how this tape should play out the tower the eight of cups the ten of wands in the reverse i feel like you are being called to walk away let this tower fall this is going to relieve a lot of pressure a lot of seeming like burden energy Okay, heavy energy, a weight lifted off your shoulders, but you're going to have to make this decision to walk away. This person could come back in, try to fight for this connection, but you really have to ask yourself, Pisces, if this is something that you can accept moving forward. If not, you're the person who has to change that. soul journey message coming out for your reading is balance i bring a state of perfect harmony into my world and i do so without judgment pisces this card talks about not only finding the balance but keeping the balance creating balance and when there is imbalance you have to realign with order i feel like this person is confirming it's time for you to focus on your own internal balance, your own internal process. This person is really resistant in the present energy to anything that's going on. Even if there isn't ill intention, you still have to be mindful of this energy. Is a person pushing you away for weeks at a time something that you think that you can accept? You know, and if it's not, then you're going to have to really ask yourself, how can I start moving forward? without focusing on this person I feel like you are already in this process Pisces because we see you feel like this person is hiding and like they have ill intention and even if they don't have ill intention 
is this energy still something that you're willing to work with you know let's say their intention isn't bad but yet this is how they respond when they have an emotional situation happen in their life is this something that you're going to want to be able to something that you're going to be able to handle or is this something that every time it's going to cause an argument and if so you need to start thinking about yourself first I feel like you're headed in a positive direction Pisces you are making the right decision by walking away just that initial one foot in front of the other so Pisces I do feel like this is a good solid message coming out thank you guys so much for all the love and support Thank you for liking, subscribing, sharing the content. You guys are all amazing. Again, if you want to get in on the extended version, the links are all below. Otherwise, thank you guys again, and I look forward to seeing your beautiful souls again soon. Namaste.